Hello everyone. Welcome back to Gitroy Tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix star field error. Graphics graphics card does not meet the minimum specification requirements error which is happening for many of the users right now and how we can fix this up. So let's dive into the work around. The first one is all about we have to make sure that is the graphics card is supported to play the game. So if you check over here you will be able to understood that is if you go to the store it is quite visible for everyone if you go to the store page if you scroll down and navigate to the minimum requirements you will be able to see that is it should be windows 10 21h1 on the os and the process should be either amd ryzen at least intel core i7 it should be having 16 gb ram and it should be having all these specifications and it should be having 125 gb of space and all these recommended things should be there 16 gb ram and everything should be there so you should be knowing how much you should be needed so you have to make sure that you know uh, it is supported with your graphics card or else you will be having the trouble so this is the first and basic step once after done with this one we have to move to the next one that is we have to update the uh, windows version to 22h2 so what we need to do is we just need to uh, i'll show you just go over here and we have to search for window version so i'll search for win like this you have to search like this just click on this one and now as you can see i'm on windows 11 and my version is 22h2 so the minimum is 21h2 or above so minus 22h2 for it is fine for me if you're on windows 10 as well as on windows 11 this is what you have to do once you understood this one if you're on uh, any lower version you need to update the settings for this just go over here to the windows update and just click on the check for updates and make sure it is up to date this is what you have to do but for some users when they do this they end up in having an issue and they are not able to update the windows so if that is the case we need to install we need to use a method that is we need to we need a support of windows 11 installation assistant in order to update the windows to the 22h2 for this i'll be providing link in the description that will take you to this so this is the uh, windows 11 installation assistant for windows 11 so if you go over here this is actually uh, the uh, Okay, we are having for both Windows uh, 10 as well as Windows 11. So I'm on Windows 11. So what we need to do is we just need to go to this link, which I'll be providing in the description. We just need to click on the download now. So what happens is it will be get downloaded, and once after this, we just need to run this exe, and it will be auto updated, and that will be working fine. So actually, as you can see, this device is already running the latest version of Windows 11. So I got this message which I am fine with this I don't have any issue so it is fine with us so we have to try with the windows 11 installation assistant you can try for both windows 10 as well as Win windows 11 I'll be providing link for both windows 10 installation assistant as well as windows 11 installation assistant after trying with this if the issue is still there you can try with the next one that is try using the uh, media creation tool for some users when they tried the help of media Uh, media creation tool it worker for them so i'll be providing link in, in the description so this is actually uh, the windows uh, over here you can see this is actually uh, the uh, installation tool for uh, media creation tool for windows 11 as well as for windows 10 the users can download this so you can download this one and once you download this one you will be getting this media creation tool as you can see so once it successfully downloaded if you're on windows so just open this and you have to run this and you need to make sure few changes when it comes over here it is quite important that you have to make few changes so you will be getting these options and this is going to take a little bit of time so you just follow the instructions just set set up everything over there and once after this update your windows and once you update the windows most probably this will be completely fixed next one even using the windows 11 assistant uh, installation assistant and even the media creation tool still the issues there the next one we have to update the graphics card so i'll be providing link in the description to both nvidia as well as for the amd So in video users have to go over here and you have to select every details over here go to the product series product should be selected and windows 11 as i am running go for start search when you go over here in the start search you will be getting this version so if you're on 5 that is 1.13 is the latest released one so download this one install and restart is a mandatory if you're on the amd just go over here in this and go for submit and once you go for submit you can see if you're on windows 11 download this one if you're on windows 10 download this one install and restart is a mandatory and try launch the game next one is all about we need to run the game on dedicated graphics card for this we just need to go over here in the search and we have to go to graphics settings now from here you can see you just need to go over here you can see this 
So I have already added the game. I'll be showing you how to add it. The game will not be by here by default. Just click on the browse. Now from here, go to this PC, go to local disk D, Steam library, Steam apps common. Now keep scrolling down star field, select this one and add it. So I have already added the game. So I have added the game. Just click on the option. Make sure this is by default. This will be let Windows decide. Change this to high performance. Go for save. Close this and we have to go back and try launch the game. Once afterwards, most probably this will be completely fixed. And this is what you have to do. I hope this video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.